Coach talked about that play at the end of the game. You know, the thought it was down. And it wasn't down. Yeah. We didn't tackle him. We didn't tackle him. Pretty similar to the Clemson play? Yeah. Brian, what was the plan on the quarterback option reads? It seemed like your ends were crashing. Was there responsibility on the tailbacks today? Okay. Who was, whose job was the quarterback? Linebackers. Kind of Line, linebackers. Okay. They just weren't getting outside like they should? I'll have to look at the film yet yeah, a number of times. Their job was to scrape? Number of times. Yeah, number of times they didn't get to Ashton, a lot of playing time today. Is that a practice earned feel or uh, scheming wise? We got, to, you know, we're looking for production out of that position, you know. So keep, um, keep it competitive. So what you saw to Jonathan Jones, obviously a tough spot for him to be in, but how did he respond? Mm. You know, he did okay. Again, I got to see the film on it. He's lined up away from me quite a bit. Um, I think he did a decent job. We had really one deep ball. You know, the one deep ball throwing at us in a gadget play back to the quarterback. It's really the passing game, you know. He's like, third and seven team, go tackle a guy, you know. Did you feel like your guys took a step back as far as tackling, just technique and getting guys down? Uh, I know they have an offense that's uh, a little different. There's a lot of responsibility issues for players, and at times it's faster. We just didn't, uh, we didn't handle that well uh, today, for the most part. And, uh, I thought we hung in there. We needed to have a, you know, we had to, needed to have a fourth quarter, and we had it all set up for that. And we, we, we miss a tackle that ends up being huge in the game. Huge. Can you put your finger on what, what about the fourth quarter the struggles are? Yeah. It was third and 17. Get a check down throw. I don't see any problem with that. That's what you want. Big play's got a deep ball. We've got three guys. All on the ball. Their guy, their guy gets it. You know, so. Give it your arm in this business. You've got to get better. You've got to coach better. Or you've got to play better. Keep saying that. And, uh, ground level, trying to build our house. It's going to take, take a lot of work. It's going to be insane. I think overall today we, uh, we came out and had a good, you know, a good fourth quarter. Uh, it could have been a day where we could point at some, some positives. I think the fourth quarter what took place in this game it was the plot of the game. Uh, we, we were successful, so we have to say that we got to regroup, look at it, and uh, try to avoid having a bit. You say you've got to build the house and take some work. You feel like these guys are in it for the long haul as far as I think so. I think we, you know, we're coming along. I mean, the guys. Uh, Practice habits are better. I think their concentration and game plan is better. Um, I just think that you know the pace of the game today and a little bit awkward offense. You know, we're not we're not really ready to execute at a high high level like we would like to right now. And again, I think we had the game. We never had control of the game, but we were kind of managing the game. And then we let it go away. We let it get away in the fourth quarter. That's about it. That somersault play from Jeff Scott, it's, it's a rare play to see, but it's happened a couple times against your defense this year. Is there anything? What is the somersault play? The, 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 where Jeff Scott somersaulted kind of over, over uh, Richardson. He rolled, he rolled on the defender for the touchdown. Oh, oh okay. We're back to that play. Kind, kind, of a, kind of a rare play, but it's happened a couple times. Is there yeah, anything Both situations are a middle linebacker tackling a running back. How hard is it, Brian, when you're when you're one and six to coach the guys? Does it get more difficult? Not hard. Not hard. I knew in the spring we had a lot of work to do. Our goal is to become the best in the country on defense. We do. I know it's a process. We've got to continue to work to improve. And uh, well, we're getting ourselves ready to play in big games in the future. And what we do right now is vitally important. It is key what we do right now in building it. And so, you know, we're evaluating how we coach, we're evaluating the players to see if you know, we're right to make that chase and pursue that. And so that's that's the mission. There's got to be some bumps and such, and obviously we're enduring that right now. But now again, I'm I'm more interested in improving, getting better, and making sure that our culture is one that's ready to.
to play championship football in the future. So the message is patience and it'll, it'll reap success? Um, I don't think that we can use the word patience in our room. I don't think the Auburn people would agree with patience. That's not our business. Um, we're trying to speed the process up. And that requires a sense of urgency from all of us. Today, today that's you know we've got to look at it, we've got to evaluate it, and see if we move in the right direction.